So inflammation, insulin resistance, oxidative stress, those are three concepts that stress or adrenal fatigue will drive and therefore increase your cancer risk. But whenever it is where you have time and bandwidth, it's important to check these markers, these biomarkers, and understand where you landed after a season of stress or in the middle of stress so that you can build a strategic plan to turn all of that around. This is why really taking this kind of holistic functional medicine approach is critical when it comes to managing your health because oftentimes you get a diagnosis that's very late and you have a diagnosis of cancer and now you have to go into a different mode of management of the active disease. Fortunately today, we understand that there is a much better way to approach health understand your risk, and to really give and deliver actionable steps. So you can decrease your risk for cancer at any age. You just have to jump in and dive into the concepts that surround your cancer risk. And here's what we know, stress and chronic stress is a big one.